Hello, I'm Salih from Turkey. And so I'm working as an engineer at General Directorate of Land Registry and Cadaster. So it's gonna be my first ever talk in uh, FOSS event. So I am a bit of excited, so please pardon me. Uh, so I would like to talk about the project, uh, like briefly talk about the project that we will develop or we are developing. So uh, firstly, Turkey's National Geographical Information System is known as TUCBS, uh, aims to coordinate geographical information infrastructure uh, among public institutions. Uh, so it's just like established by uh, presental uh, degree and in starting with 2000, 11, so Directorate of General, uh, General Directorate of Geographical Information System has handed over this uh, uh, mission to like maintain data and sharing. And the project overview is just coordinating standard topographical maps uh, produced by map department of the, uh, our uh, institution. So we have our own plane to like uh, creating uh, orthophotos and aerial images uh, started in two, uh, 1955. So it involves photogrammetric uh, photogrammetric based map production at uh, in a 5,000 scale covering uh, 480,000 kilometers square. And so like when we create raster data, so we have some challenges. So raster data presents issues such as deformation, uh, distortion, and varying quality. Uh, accessing these characteristics is crucial for uh, automatic automation and ensuring data accuracy. So we were using quantum JS uh, to utilize this uh, raster data and like coordination processes, uh, particularly on Ankara uh, sheet. Uh, also, like open source software offers uh, flexibility and community-driven support for us, like to enhance uh, project management and customization. Uh, so we have successfully coordinated uh, 1,967 raster sheets, uh, demonstrating the effectiveness of the open source tools. Uh, so work is underway to publish a total of uh, 82,000 data via web service using GeoServer. Uh, the process of, of uh, publishing old uh, data has been completed and the process of publishing current data is in progress. Uh, so we have also our requirements when it comes to like share data and manage data. So we are sharing our data using uh, our geoportal that we have developed beforehand, so called metadata geoportal. Uh, so we are just making a web presentation of those kind of data using GeoServer, again like using uh, Geotiff. So in the uh, this slide, so you are able to see our uh, web portal called Metadata, a Geo Metadata. So so when we use the open source approach, so it just shows us it's a cost effective, sustainable, and accessible to broad user base, and so proposes a model for widespread adoption uh, of this approach uh, in a similar projects. Uh, so, conclusion, so improvements in map management process highlight the project success. Uh, so, like, advocate for the adoption of the open source approach in the comparable projects. So, also, like, it's important step towards the dig uh, digitization of the public institutions. So, and thanks for listening. Uh, thank you. Thank you.